Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In the previous lecture, we have discussed about the adsorption of methane and carbon dioxide with the help of spun adsorption. Like this was feed, it was consist of methane, carbon dioxide. This was a flow rate, pressure and temperature. This was bed. It was one layer and it follow the momentum energy balance, the kinetic and the isothermal extended length where to the bed was 0.62 meter height and it was 0.016 meter in dia and the internal inter, uh, interparticle void edge this was all information about the bed okay this was the initial value and this was the product temperature and pressure etc now we also make some plots now we will make some other plots like go to the flow sheet form go to the profile plot and i am adding some uh, i am uh, drawing some plots like the solid loading along the height and okay this one click on bed click on configure go to results go to the solid loading solid loading okay now right click profile property click on profile property here solid loading methane and carbon dioxide okay the methane drag and drop this one to the ch4 loading methane at font number 12 so at, i will change it to the steric to make it for whole height or whole length of the column so what will be the methane loading inside the whole column? So what will be the methane loading inside the whole column or the whole height of the column? So and what will be the carbon dioxide loading inside the whole adsorption column? So CO2 loading. okay now we will find other variable like the height what will the height how can we determine the height of the column so we will click on find variable click on browse go to block go to bed click on ok here type variable length or height so the length axial distance the maximum axial distance of this column is 0 0.1 Six two meter. So drag and drop this one, and this is the height. Height. Okay. So height is on the x-axis. Click on x-axis. The methane is on the y-axis. The carbon dioxide is on the y-axis. And now I will change to time. What will be the? We suppose what will be the methane uh, loading? at 50 second after 50 second inside the column under the inside the whole column what will be the methane and carbon dioxide loading after 100 second inside the whole column uh, what will be the methane and carbon dioxide loading after 150 second after 200 second okay okay methane carbon dioxide and height click on apply click on ok now maximize this one and here the height the height is 1 0 point 0 point 162 0 0.01 fly so, click on ok right click on it go to the full form 
okay now click on property map access one for each fly click on okay now here you can see this is here you can see at time 0 50 100 150 200 this is time 0 50 uh, this is for carbon dioxide this is for methane so here you can see the carbon dioxide at 50 second after 50 second it is increases carbon dioxide load is increases it is increases it is increases it is also increases but if you see the methane loading the methane loading it is increasing after 100 second so for carbon dioxide the carbon dioxide loading is very very large as you can see that is very large and the maximum loading of co2 here you can see is at 100 second and it is about this from here you can see Zurfan 00217 kilogram kilomole per kilogram of absorbent so the solid loading of carbon dioxide now we can uh, float another uh, graphs like go to this go to the profile plot like some other plot like temperature temperature along the height click on ok go to fund prof variable profile variable click on fund variable browse temperature uh, this is the bed click on ok length double click the length of the whole column is height of the column is 0 0.162 this one and this is the height h is for height okay now close this one and we will go to the temperature like temperature okay case temperature case temperature suppose yes temperature inside the column okay now this is on the x axis and temperature is on the y axis and time suppose what will be the methane and carbon dioxide temperature after uh, specify time after 50 second inside the whole adsorption column what will be the methane and carbon dioxide temperature after 100 second in the whole column 150 second what will be the methane and carbon dioxide temperature after 200 second in the whole column click on apply click on ok here you can see click on full and maximize this so here you can see after 200 second the temperature remain constant the temperature of the gas remain constant it become constant after 100 second it is decreasing inside the column the temperature of the gas is decreases after 50 second it decreases it decreases very very it decreases sharply after this height you can see it decreases along the height of the column so double click on this one it is about 162 next okay there you can see now we will float some other like go to this one pressure the height click on ok find profile variable 
find variable click on browse it is in block bed ok length axial distance is 0.162 meter case velocity this is distance this is about distance so distance axial layer distance this is height height okay close this one this is as you see bed layer axial distance okay length close this one close this one this is okay bed specification go to results and fresher fresher so here go to the fresher suppose 14 or some other you can select fresher pressure gas pressure when the element gas pressure inside the absorption column okay so now okay this is the height length or height it is on the x-axis pressure is on the y-axis and uh, what will be the pressure specified time what will be the pressure of the gases inside the column after 50 second 100 second 150 second and second click on a fly cross this one you can see you can go to the property map axis one for each apply click on ok there you can see height i'll change it zero one okay this this one so here you can see that the pressure of the gases are decreases along the height of the column it decreases along the height of the column from 10 to about you can see this 9.99 something so after 200 second the pressure decrease very very small as you can see at time zero it is it sharply decrease then become constant so that the, the, the pressure decreases here you can see pressure decreases inside the column with time you can also plot some other drop like gas temperature solid loading 